I've been hauling Mississippi State Athletics for 36 years. I actually just started to help them out. They said, can you do it until we can find somebody? And so now I laugh and say, uh, 36 years later, they have not found anybody. Everett Kennard has seen it all when it comes to Bulldog baseball. I've seen it in the, in the glory days of 1985. 89. But for this year's team, it's amazing. It's, it's one of the most resilient groups I've ever seen or ever been associated with. And what a great job this staff has done with this team. And speaking of the team, every year the veterans go to the back. So you can get a guy like, uh, like uh, Hunter Stovall. He's going to be in the last seat next to the bathroom on the driver's side. And right in front of him is going to be Jake Mangle. And so the veterans are back there. And you don't go, you don't put anybody in their seat. But the good thing is, if I go back there and I see a messy place, I can guarantee you I know who it is because I know where they sit. Mr. Everett, or Big E as the players like to call him, learned the hard way why it's so important for him to drive this particular bus. With all the superstitions that come with playing baseball, well, it's no surprise that the bus number is so important to the Mississippi State baseball team. We like bus 894. This is bus 894. And uh, if it's got a lot of wins in it this year. And I had to bring another bus one time. And uh, some of the coaching staff noticed this was an 894. So uh, we've had to be sure that we use this same bus that's got all the W's in it. Over 30 years, and Big E still loves sitting behind the big wheel. I work for the greatest people. I work with the greatest people. And I've got the greatest product in America, the easiest product to sell, and that's Mississippi State University. And uh, what a pleasure it's been because it's my school, it's my town, it, it's my people. Covering the Bulldogs in Omaha, I'm Rachel Orchlinski, three on your side.